And welcome back, Gamer Nation. SKS here with another episode of No Man's Sky. We're going to start this episode off a little di different. I have been traveling around the Euclid galaxy trying to find what I wanted, and I finally found it. A space station and galaxy, or not a galaxy, but a solar system that actually has a heavy fighter in it. Now, is it like a super amazing fighter? No, it's pretty much like a basic looking red, but the slots are amazing. That I've seen just the A's have somewhere in the ballpark of 35 or more. So I'm going to try to net one of these. It's probably going to cost me a good 40 to 60 million. Uh, which is, I'm it, it's gl I'm glad that when I was on the last episode, we were working on the fr uh, freighter and some things. And I'm glad I didn't spend a lot of my money because I'm getting ready to sink maybe 80% of the remaining funds that I have. Uh, in this, uh, as you can see up here, I got 128 million units. But I'm going to spend a lot of them trying to uh, find this here. And um, we are in the VG star system, which has four planets. I've only come to this one planet here, uh, and that's it. Uh, but as you can see here, it is Viking. It is a flourishing experimental economy. But uh, as I've been sitting here beautiful planet these trees here actually turn colors going from red to a light blue it reminds me of something from Goftopia. um but i have been sitting here waiting for the fighter to land so that you all could see it but there is a lot of big ships here i am obviously waiting for an s class one to land and i'm gonna jump on it there's a shuttle there's that you could see there's just all sorts i wish even one would land just so you all could see it um, but yeah, there's a lot of really nice explorers here too that we may want to jump on to. But, uh, this is, this has got me kind of excited that we could actually get the new upgrade. As much as I hate to see the Chubane go, go weary, uh, to replace it, which I got to pay attention. Do you see my damage potential there and the core? I'm looking for one that's got a lot more core because if I'm going to have a fighter, I want it to be able to, well, you know, fight. Uh, so I'm waiting for the S class fighter. I wish like one would just land so you all could see what it looks like because uh, I don't really want to waste too much time as we've hit a journey milestone here. Uh, 12 souls on extreme worlds. Yeah, this place is pretty nasty. It's uh, heat storms coming up ever so often. But uh, we'll wait for the next batch to come in. They're not utilizing all of their stuff. But yeah, this planet is... It's bright. That's the only thing I'll have against it. It is, is a very bright planet. Um, but besides that, it is pretty beautiful. Look, oh, you can see kind of the tree there. How it's turning red. And then the tips up here turn like a green. Oh, there it is. There's what I'm looking at right there. This fighter. It is a heavy fighter. This one is B3510. Um, obviously I'm waiting for an S to come through, but this is what I'm looking at. It's not the most beautiful. There's something up there. I can't really, but, uh, just to show you all kind of what these will look like. Let me go up here to loon here and offer him interloper trade blank begins now. Okay. He's very, uh, very, very, uh, crazy, but as you can see the B here. Um, Look at all the spots that you got for just general and then technology. We've got a full row and then some others. That is just amazing as we got another superheated rainstorm coming. But you can compare it. There are another another row here that we can mess with. Uh, so we go from 28 to 35. And then obviously the technology. A whole lot more to put there, which is going to be valuable when we jump. Now obviously this is a B. I'm waiting for an S, but this is what I'm looking for. This is the goal of the start of this episode. There's a B fighter. Um, these rainstorms are making it a little bit difficult. So I'm having to hide under here and wait with these Viking dudes while it happens. But as soon as I find the S in that, and they all seem to be red here, which is okay with me. I like the color red. Uh, but I do like it to look a little spacey. And I don't think you could change that yet. But. I'm going to sit here and hold out, and um, when I find it, I will go to you and let you see that firsthand. So, until that time. So, just a little update. I'm still waiting on the right ship to land. I know it's not my favorite looking heavy fighter, 
But it is a fighter that I'm willing to wait on the S because I think that once we get this, we'll be able to maybe debate going to different galaxies and heading toward the center of everything. But I just wanted to give you all an update because I did find out there is a variation. You can get an A class like we have and pay like 50,000 nanites to upgrade it. Like, I can make this A194 fighter, probably like a S215 or something like that. It is a small fighter or medium, because it's kind of like ours. But like, no, it's small. But like, I really don't want to do that, because we've not bought anything in ages. And I have the units, which I'm going to lose like 70 or 80 million of those really fast. But like, 50,000 nanites is a lot. And I've been doing a lot of stuff to get nanites. So I think I'm just going to wait passionately for the right ship and then purchase it because I think it's worth farming to continue this Let's Play. And uh, I really want to open up a lot of uh, new avenues. And then, like I said, we're getting ready to work on the freighter missions and things like that. So I think we're on the cusp. These planes go through the land over here of really figuring it out because the heavy fighter looks amazing it's a lot longer than what i have it's a little boxy the one that i I've, I've found but i like it there is a c-15 fighter but that's not what i'm looking for there is one that i saw here on this planet not this one though i do like this but it's really similar to ours except for the nose um oh yeah and there's different colors yeah the one that i found is predominantly red i don't know if i like that but I'm not going to be choosy right now because you don't really see the outside of your ship that much. But uh, when I find the S one, I will let you all know and I will be super excited about it. So just be ready for that. So I will see you all in a little bit. All right. So I've got things paused right now and uh, I went even out of the game because an exotic just landed here. And I usually don't jump at these, but it's six million dollars and I've made some money by just scanning stuff from different systems. But, uh, this thing looks freaking awesome. Let's go into the camera mute mode. Hold on. Uh, let me go ahead and, uh, move the sun here so you all can see this. Maybe, if, maybe if I, oh, no, 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 no. I don't want it to go away. So, yeah, you all could check this out. It looks freaking amazing. And, uh, like I said, I don't see a lot of exotics. I've still been looking for that S class, but I think I'm going to go ahead and spend the money on this. Just because it is different. It's a fun, cool ship. Um, I hate that, like, in the time that I've been sitting here, which has been hours, to be honest with you all, over the span of a couple of days, I've spent two to three hours. Um, I'm almost to the point where when that ship lands again, I'm just going to buy the A version. But this gives me hope. Um... But, uh, yeah, I kind of like this. It's just, it is exotic, it is different. I'm going to take a picture of this. Because that is pretty awesome. Usually I cut out when I take pictures. But let's talk to him. And uh, just see what this has. Trade something warrior ancestors. Uh, make an offer on the ship. It is an S-Class. I mean, for six million bucks... It's not bad at all. Obviously, I'm not going to use it for anything, but uh, just buy, buy it flat out. If we could exchange it and, you know, we don't get anything back. But, yeah, I'm just going to flat out buy this. Let's see what it looks like inside. Oh, it's got that round. That's cool. That is very cool. Let me just take it off here. Oh, I love that it's like... Holy cow! Like, when you do a barrel roll, you really do a barrel roll here. And then, uh, let me go back to my training post here. And we'll land on the other side. But I do like when it lands, it opens its wings. Actually, it clips through the ground. That's pretty bad for an exotic to have that issue, but here we are. Alright, that's neat! Very cool. Very cool. Um, yeah, I wanted to share that with you all. That kind of freaked me out when I saw that, but it is ours now. Let me jump back in the old Chubain. 
and uh, we'll see how long it takes for the um, the other ship to show up because uh, with that exotic showing up that like I said that gives me somewhat of hope that is an S uh, we were waiting for the S for the other one but a lot of other big ships here but uh, I guess I'll go ahead and drop down another save here and uh, I'll continue looking for my elusive heavy fighter guys it finally happened it finally spawned I have been sitting here for ages and now I gotta get up here to it in the storm and buy it the Heavy Fighter 38S. We can buy more stuff for it. Oh my god. I have been here for, I want to say, three days in a row and four hour things. Look at this. We could buy an Outright for 57 million. It's got so many more slots 28 to 38. Um, damage potential 281. We can, I have to take it because it's an S. Uh, this will be our first heavy fighter. Uh, so yeah, we're just going to buy it outright. <sighs> 249 core. My current one is 203.4. Shield strength 185. My current's 186. So that's without anything. This is a big deal. Let's get in here and check out what this looks like. I cannot believe this just happened. It has been so many days of me messing around, trying to get this to happen. And finally, 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 I was actually watching a stream of somebody while I was doing this, and it finally took place. Oh my God, it took so long. We'll have to come up with a really cool name for it. But uh, I am super excited. I guess now... Look at the technology slots. There's, there's, oh man, there's so many. We go from 28, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh my God, this is, this is great. This is great. I'm obviously going to have to move stuff around and check it out. The hyperdrive is broke. But, uh, oh man, this is, this is big. This is big. Okay, so obviously what we got to do. is take this up and see what it's going to be like. Oh, this is so cool. I did not think that it was ever going to spawn, but here we are. This is awesome. There's an amazing view of it so you can see it up front or up close. Oh, it looks so cool. Now, I know there's other S fighters out there and stuff, and a lot of people like the needle ones, but this was the first one we come in contact with, and I really just wanted to get one so that we could upgrade it, and it would have a lot more storage and stuff, and I think we've accomplished that. So this is freaking amazing. I am I am super stoked about the first S. Um, I guess the only thing we'll have to do next is look for a multi-tool, but my God, I cannot believe this. This is... It took so long to get to this. I'm just, I'm going to take a break from the game for a while now. Obviously, from editing, it's going to go from what, what I was to this to the next thing. But I'm just going to let you all know, I'm going to take a little break. And then I'll come back and uh, we'll continue those missions. Uh, yeah, this is awesome. I'm so static. She's all nice and home now. I could finally rest for a bit. And then... It's going to be time to go spend nanites and upgrade everything in here. So that's going to be pretty cool to start that. I also think I need to change my suit color to maybe a reddish so it matches with my uh, ship. Oh, this is awesome. I'm so grateful. Super thanks to these April Patreon supporters. If Patreons were green beans, I'd can them and keep them in my basement. Zachary McKinley, James Matisse, Nicholas Absher, Least Expected, Party Commissar, Azure Rain, and Critias Zero.